it's like we just didn't stream a different game. But now we're here for this. Hi. Hello, how are you guys doing? We just got done playing a game called uh, Sword and Sauce. It went okay. The coffee hadn't hit me yet. Maybe I should have played the chill game first, then played the other one once the coffee hit me. Well, I don't know. Anyway, Sugar Shot gave me this game. I don't know anything about it, but promised that it would be somewhere along the lines of a Stardew-esque thing. Um, we will see. It's called Cat Tales. I think you play as a cat. It looks adorable. It's all that really matters, right? Um, based on like the, uh, I, I don't know what the name of it is. And maybe you guys do. What's the name of that thing with the cats? Warrior cats? Okay, so the aspect ratio is like slightly off. It's like not proper. I don't want it to be full screen, but I also, like you see those black bars? That's just, can you fit the screen properly? It's a little bit weird. It's like not fully 16 by nine. Whoa, oh God, okay. Sorry about that. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just chop off like a pixel or two. There we go. Anyway. Here's Cattails. It's a new game. New game. Please select a difficulty later. You can change this later anytime you want in the settings menu. This seems like one of those like um It feels as if we're gonna have like a uh, Doki Doki Literature Club experience. Um, let's go with normal. Oh shit, I get to be my own cat. Okay, I get to choose what kind of cat I am. Momo, where you at? Are you eating the carpet? Momo, come here. I'll FaceTime or uh, FaceCam if I've got a cat, but I was hoping that the cat would actually help me. So we can, uh, red looks weird. I've never had a ginger cat. Mo Momo is more along like this color, like these two. Um, pink looks awful. Black just looks soulless. I think cat's eyes should be yellow. And I think our cat will be gray. Looks good. Like the demon cat, I'm not a fan of. She's a torty. Do the white eyes. All right. My steam friends on, so I'm gonna turn that off. All right, I'm gonna turn that off. There we go. All right. Need to pick a name. Oh, I ex so apparently escape quits out of the game entirely. I just I thought it would quit out of the uh, typing thing. Give me a name for a cat while we're doing this. And we're not gonna go with the warrior cat thing because I don't know anything about warrior cats and I don't plan on learning. Grits. Grits. It is. Grits. Grits. That's such, like, not a good cat name. I love it. Grits. Grits lump. 
Gritzlow. 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 Aw. We adopt we got adopted. Cute little girl taking care of her new cat, which is us, I guess. We're just a little kitten with a huge head and an awkward body. Mom is just like whatever, but I mean the kid's awesome with it. But the mom mom is all loud and angry. Oh. Oh, what a bitch. Are you making us give away the cat? Oh, what the fuck? Fuck you, mom. Oh, come on now. Don't do that to a cat. What the fuck is that? Just let just go to an adoption agency. We can't have this cat anymore. Please take it. Get fucked, mom. New quest is now to murder that. Okay. Hey, what are you doing here? That's a good question. You don't look like you're around from around here, says Coco. I'm Coco, by the way. I knew that because it said. Why don't you come over here and tell me your name? Yeah, it's raining. Why did you drop off a cat by the side of the road while it's raining? You can move your cat with Wazda. Try it out and talk to Coco. I mean, cool, All right? Hum, is that your name's Gritzlop? Yes. That's a good name for you, if you don't mind me saying. It says Coco. See where you're left here all by yourself, dropped off by the side of the road? How terrible. Well, if that's your story, you got a lot of learning ahead of you. You go fend off your friend for yourself here in the wild. I think the capture region is cut off. Um, it's the ca capture region for this game's a little weird. Like it's got a black border on the top and bottom by like one pixel, so I can kind of like zoom it in just a little bit, but not easily. It's it's just gonna involve some cutting off and or not um, by just a hair. Just like slightly too large. Or slightly too small. I guess we'll just go with empty. Anyway. Wait until the full UI comes up. Okay. If you don't know how to forge, uh, hunt, and fight, you can't expect to live more than a few days. You better listen to everything I say. I can show you how to survive these parts. First things first, you'll have to know how to forage. There should be gold, some golden seal around here. It's a leaf green plant with bright red berry. We use it to patch up wounds. Why don't you find some gold seal and bring it to me? Shouldn't be too hard to locate it. And uh, let me know if you need some help. Okay, I'm gonna assume that's what this is over here. Did I do it? No, it's over here. I got it. Okay, I got. It. There we go. Looks like you found some golden seal. Why don't you try get? Why is it called golden seal if it's red and green? can open my inventory. Oh, I can change my color. Huh. Just at random. Hello, that's not what I meant to do. Here, hold. Oh, that's adorable. Great work, you'll be forging like a pro soon enough. Go ahead and keep that golden seal, by the way. Never know when it'll come in handy. I'll leave it in your inventory. There's a lot of prints that go around here in the wild, gold seal, Lavender, catnip, marigold, just to name a few. They all have their unique, unique uses, and just to make sure everyone knows, I'm still dyslexic and still dumb. I notice a lot of people are still commenting on the uh, Doki Doki videos, being like, You're dyslexic? God, this guy barely fucking knows how to read. It's like, yeah. I notice. Just remember, all plants need time to grow back after they've been harvested, and some plants will only grow in certain seasons. What? M multiple seasons in this game? You're going to need how to find food for yourself. You need how to re eat regularly and stay healthy and be alive. 
I've been, like, not eating regularly. You need some plants like berries and licorice root, but they don't fill you up very fast. Mainly, you want to eat prey and then catch with your own paw. Okay, great. Do I know how to hunt? No. I'm, like, barely a year old, if that. First, sneak around. They won't hear you coming. Then find a mouse and get close so you can focus on it. You don't want to get as close as possible without him scaring him off. Then, the closer you get, the better chance you have of catching a mouse. Don't worry, mice aren't very good at spotting us cats, so you can get pretty close. Then pounce on the mouse. It's a weird graphic for a cat, but I mean, I guess it's hard to... Rev, get Chronog to cover this game. Yeah. Uh, I'll message them. Then pounce on the mouse once you're focused and ready. If you did it ri just right, you'll have a nice meal waiting for you in the grass. Don't worry, if you miss your first few tries, hunting is tricky, blah, blah, blah. You got that? Okay, go and hunt some shit. He didn't say shit, because he's a cat. Oh. Okay. Wait for the focus bar to... Oh, fuck. Okay, there's a the mouse. Okay, that was awful. I'm really bad at being a cat. So I, I actually want that to load. I got it backwards. Okay, I gotta get a little closer. See, I thought that loading thing was him looking at me. Fucking mice. I love this walking animation and this music. It's totally the sound that this cat would make. Yeah! Yeah! Anyway, hold this. There you go. What's up? Nicely done! You're a natural hunter, grit slump. Not really. You need a whole lot more than one measly mouse to keep yourself fed in the top shape, so don't let it get to your head. You can find all sorts of prey throughout the wilderness. Most of them will see you coming from a lot further away than a mouse will. See, I, have to stay, see, I thought I had to get within the red ring without the blue ring loading. And that was the opposite of it. You can always uh, get better at... Oh, I have... I have a skill, like, there's skills that I can upgrade. Okay. All that hard work is probably making you hungry, so why don't you try eating the mouse you just caught? You need in order to eat, you need to eat in order to survive in cattails. Let's see how hungry your cat is in the bottom left corner. If your hunger is reduced to zero, you'll start taking damage from starvation. It looks like you're a little hungry right now, so go ahead and eat the mouse and blah, blah, blah. Okay. Wait, where'd the... Oh, I'm holding it. No, I'm not. It was on the ground. Okay. Eat. Cool. I'm not hungry anymore. Good. Just make sure you keep an eye on how hungry you are, Gort Slump. Could be the difference between life and death. Now then, do you have any special skills? Any sort of training? Or I mean, I'm a, I'm a house cat. No? None at all? Well, that's not surprising. I'm about to teach you a Coco specialty skill called Sprint. You can also use it to gain a quick burst of speed. You can sprint to cover ground quickly. Uh, just running, right? I'm not gonna kill Coco. There's no reason to kill Coco. He taught me how to run. Just now. I'd never thought of the concept of moving slightly faster. Okay. You can press one. Yes, that's just how it's done. Okay. Right. You can have four active skills at any time. Experiment with different combos. Find out what that works for you. Passive skills, hunting, fighting, foraging, and swimming. And then, okay. Then you have active skills, which are just active abilities. Okay, cool. Gotcha. I'm sorry, what? Border clashes? Uh, so how about we spar real quick? Fair warning, I won't go in easy on you just because you're new. Like, I literally just got dropped off and this guy is like, Alright, I'm going to teach you how to survive. Here's how you get medicine. Here's how you kill. Now we're going to have a knife fight. Bring it on. Okay. 
Ready to spar with me? I mean, yeah, I guess. All right, Four, few pointers before we begin. Cats fight by pawing at each other with their claws. It takes some time to complete an attack. During that time, you won't be able to react uh, to my attacks, so just time your attacks right. You want to make your agility, use of your agility to, to get my attacks. Anticipate my swipes and get out of the way before they hit. Remember, I'll be vulnerable while attacking because I won't be able to turn around or move. Same goes for you. Ready? Three, two, one. Go attack. Ow. I mean... Shit. I mean, I don't really know how to, like... Okay. You put a good fight, Grit Slump. You got a lot to learn, but you're not bad for a beginner. I'm really not sure how to, like... Fight... Right. Can I say it in more cat voice? Yeah. You can always become better at fighting by spending experience on your passive fighting skill in your skill panel. Fighting is an excellent way to flex your political muscle, too. Every few days, the battle will begin on the borders of uh, the colonies. If you participate, you can help any col you can help a colony gain influence over an area. Speaking of colonies, you surely would want to join one. It's a great way. What the fuck is this game? Fire and Why? Why is it like this? Cat knife fight. Imagine Greece, but with cats. That's what this is. It's. Why do I have to worry about politics? I'm a cat. I'm playing a video game about cats so I don't have to worry about politics. There are three major colonies here that the spirit did to give... Uh, if you like it. We're actually not far from the forest colony right now. I can leave... Who are you with? You've taught me everything I know about surviving. I'm sure our, their leader, Mayor, would not mind a new face around town. They're good cats in the forest colony and you'll fit right in. How does that sound? I mean, sure. Great! Welcome to the forest colony, Grit Slump's Den. Here we are, this is your new den, Grit Slump. This is where you live. It's really sad, actually. You can sleep and save your progress and also use it to save your items. Save progress frequently in your bed. It's a good idea to save before sleeping every night. This is where we'll have to part ways, Grit Slump. I hope you always remember your training well. It's nice to meet you. We may meet each other again soon. I've had a busy day. Why don't you sleep get some sleep? What the fuck? What'd you like to do? I'd like to save the game. I'm apparently tripping balls. Cats just do that. Good morning. Okay, I gotta say, like, the cat's faces, like, their little icons, kinda creep me the fuck out. Like, that's just, that's not how faces work. My name is Mayor. Like, that, that's kinda weird to me. This... I'm the leader of the forest colony. I'm here to give you a warm welcome. I hope you found your den comfortable enough. We're keeping it nice and tidy, just in case if someone like you came along. We'll find that we're pretty... Introduce yourself when you get a chance. Make sure you know Ember, our shopkeeper. You should also say hello to Doc, our healer. He's just kind of set up with that one. It's one of those things where you're named, like, Smith. Probably a lot of people named Smith running around, you know, where, where it's like, you know, uh, your last name, your last name is Smith because, like, you had someone that you, like, were related to that was the, the town blacksmith. There's probably a lot of people named Smith. I was just thinking about this. There's probably a lot of people named Smith because blacksmiths weren't going out to war and dying, right? There's not a lot of people named, like, I don't know. Killer. 
Like, your last name's not Killer. You know? Explain the name Dickinson. It's true. Okay, I just... Okay, right. Oh, we're preparing for a summer festival. We hope you join us for the festivities. The cats of every colony come together with the sacred temple at the end of each season for the festivals. There's usually fun games and prizes you can win. So you guys are like... You guys that like... War? Like... But you have parties? Like... How does this... What? Is this cat Hogwarts? I don't know, dude. Hey, Ember. What's... What's good? Get fucked! Sorry. Hi there! Have you come to check out my fine wares? I, have we met before? Allow me to introduce myself. They call me Ember. I run the store around here and I've got lots of stuff for sale. So stop by if you need anything. I hope to see you around. Okay. Yes. Would you like to buy or sell? What What do I even buy from a cat? Oh, random animals and things. Black, oh, I can change. The unit of money is a mew. So if I just like mew at you 120 times? Oh. Oh, there's other color options, better ones. I like the sweater and the scarf and the bell. Uh, let's talk. I I don't know how to feel about this game so far. I don't know if it's cute or creepy. It's it's bordering between the two. Okay, you can you can have that. I don't know what it's for. Anyway, there you go. Yeah. Okay, bye. Nerd Baron, thank you for five months of support. Star Mew Valley. Yes. That sounds right. Are there just like a pile of dead animals here? Let's sneak into your house here. What is this? Okay. What about the surname Woodcock? Alright. Get fucked. I'm just gonna pick up random animals because I, I don't really know how to do anything. I'm not a very good cat yet. Where's the other person? There's another person that lives here. There's. There's Mayor, there's Ember, and there's Doc. Forget what Doc does. Oh, hey, Missy, what's up? And Sarge. Um, who are you and what do you want from me? Jesus Christ. The prompt to enter a den is E. Okay. Majestic as fuck. I'm Missy, and I'm the most important cat in the forest. Leave me be, you're wasting my time, yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna leave you alone because you're kind of a bitch. I guess I shouldn't call a cat a bitch. What's a female cat called? She was a little catty. See, I, I, I like that joke. I'm gonna steal it and pretend like it's mine. She's the Haley of this game. Yeah, that sounds right. A pussy? I think all cats are pussies. Who are you? I don't think I know you. I guard the forest colony, so watch what you're doing or I'll have a problem. Means they're all kind of named as they would be. Hello there, how are you doing today? Okay, kind of creepy. Okay. Doc's in. Okay. Um, so I, I believe I've met everyone now. Unless if I can go and... Oh, wait, no, there's Lyris now. I'm gonna bet he's a musician. Because everyone's kind of named what they do. A female cat is called a queen if she's pregnant or nursing a litter. Otherwise, she's called a molly. Okay. Hey. Good day to you, my rose. Ah, uh, like a fresh breeze. Yeah, you're... You're... My name is Lyris. I hope you will stop by again. It was such a pleasure to meet someone as squid as it is squazit as you. There you go. Squazit? You guys like exquazit? 
Like it when I pronounce exquisite, exquisite. I got like the best house. It's like right in the center of fucking town. Why does Lyris live outside of the walls of town? Like, surely if we're under attack, like it'd be better to be inside the walls. Actually, Mayor got a really good house. I mean, I live under a rock. This is Mayor's den. Okay. Okay. Well, I guess that's town. I have no idea what I'm doing with myself. Okay. Okay, let's go and get some of these. Gold seal seems to be like a constant, like you should probably get that sort of thing. Cats write signs. I don't know things about cats, apparently. Oh, it's like squirrels and shit. Gotta go hunt and forage. I guess instead of farming, you just sort of hunt all the time. Shit. What is that? Is that coral? Why is there coral on land? Oh, fuck. Yeah, get it. What is that? Okay, I'm shit at swimming. Lavender. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just sort of being a cat. If I see something, I attack it. I mean, obviously, if I don't see something, I don't attack it. So it's kind of self-explanatory. What is that? Oh, it's a bird. Okay. I'm gonna totally fuck this one up. Fuck. I'm probably gonna starve to death. I don't feel like it's shovelware, because, like, it feels like an attempt was made. But I don't understand what I'm doing. This is Stardew Valley meets Warriors. Yeah, that sounds right. I never read the Warrior Cats thing. Rushing Rocks. Who owns Rushing Rocks? Do I have to worry about wandering into someone else's territory? Oh, I see. There's different colors at the top, and that shows what tribe owns it. So, like, it's, it's all colors, so it's, like, owned by all of them. So, Forest Central is owned by us. The forest... I mean, it's all in a forest, so everyone is part of a forest tribe, right? That's how living in a forest works. It's neutral. So, it's probably, like, green, red, and blue. And if it's all three equally, then it's all three equally. Abandoned Cottage. I need to even go find something to, to hunt. I'm gonna starve to death very soon here. Okay, hold on. I see something. Is that a squirrel? Let's try and sneak up on that dude. You don't notice shit. Damn it! It's getting dark. I'm gonna starve to death. I was bad at being a cat today. 6 p.m. All right, I'm gonna go hunt something. I gotta find something to eat. Okay. Don't notice me, you stupid bitch. Nah, God damn it. I don't know if I got it or not. I can't see it, so there's no way to know. Maybe if I like, yeah, there he is. He forgot about me already. I might have to pick berries or something. I'm gonna probably have a hard time the first few days. But I need to get better at like hunting so I can pounce farther. Cause I'm very hungry. You can use the strong scent to gain power from your colony in an area, okay? Or a common summon, uh-huh. Licorice root, a naturally sweet plant that makes for a good light snack. Okay, let's eat that. I don't even remember what 
that looked like. I think it was just looked like a bundle of logs, right? Can you eat butterflies? That's a good question. Can you eat butterflies? No. You can't. The weirdly accurate shadows. A little bit bizarre. What is this game? This is, uh, Cattails. I'm a cat. I'm a feral cat. And I'm part of the Forest Tribe? Pouncer. Okay. Can I eat cattails? No. Apparently they are edible, but they probably taste like ass. Fairy wood. Okay, I'm lost. Is there a map? <sighs> okay, I can, uh... Hunting. Used for finding, tracking, and killing play. At higher level... Or higher levels, a hunter will be able to... Be better at pouncing on small creatures, focusing his or uh Okay. Yeah, let's upgrade that. That seems like the basic survival thing, like being able to eat. Sounds important. Okay, I don't know how to get back home. Forest Lake, where the fuck am I? Like I don't know this this stuff. What is this stuff? There we go. That was the trick. I just need to be able to, like, pounce farther. There we go. Now I'm better. One upgrade was enough to make it, like, viable to do things. Go down the brick paths. Ah, oh, there we go. Here's the forest colony. This is just slightly out of the way. Good. Okay. Alright, well, today wasn't a great day, but, I mean, like, first day being a cat, not knowing the fuck I'm doing... Not the worst. Let's go to sleep. It says to save before going to sleep. I wish it would save while you sleep. That would make sense. Okay. And then I guess I go talk to people. Or cats. Doc scares me. He's just weird looking. Sarge, what's up? Well, I saw Pouncer. This is such a star- I mean, like, Stardew is a Harvest Moon knockoff. Scout, did you need something? I don't know you. How about we change that right now? My name's Scout. I work for Mayor. Our little colony relies on my skill to make sure our borders are safe for all. It isn't a glamorous job, but someone's gotta do it. Did you need something? Do you ever come down with a bad case of the munchies? Because I've had a bad case of the munchies right now. I've had a big meal, but my stomach's not yet satisfied. You got anything to spare? No. I can barely survive. I'm still having a hard time deciding if this is cute or not. It isn't shot. What would you like to do? I would like to sell. I would like to sell these butterflies. And that. Yes. I'm interested in selling that, and then the painted butterfly as well. You don't have a, I mean, aesthetically, it reminds me a lot of Stardew, but like, functionally in every way, it's not at all like Stardew. Like, what on earth is this game? I don't really know, but I was given it, so I'm gonna try it. I was like, hey, that could be good. Do I like it though? I don't know how I feel about it. If I am being perfectly honest. Leaning towards, I don't think I like it, but I'm not entirely sure yet. Farm catnip? I mean, that could be the reason that Scout has the munchies. Just doing a shit ton of catnip. I think I have an intervention for Scout, because he's just like, doing lines of catnip every day and, and it's to the point that we can't even have a functioning society so we gotta talk to him girl who are these fuck who are you don't tell anyone but I got a mouse back in my den he's too cute to eat I'm gonna break into your house and eat it cause I'm going to starve have we met I don't think so 
Okay, so you guys are like not important NPCs. That's why you have soulless black eyes. I mean, I didn't know cats had it. So tired. She's just looking at me like, just, just feed me so I can go to sleep. I feel it, dude. I mean, the pounce is just short of where I need it to be. Like it's so okay. Let me let me explain one thing that I've got kind of a huge issue with right now. The pounce range is shorter than the the range I need to be able to like So if I'm moving it scares them or if I'm just if I just stand still will that scare them? Like can I just wait for them to come to me? Like this one's headed his way towards me. So I can just hide here. Also sprint to rush at prey. I mean, I'm trying to do the pouncing thing like it intends. Like, why even have a pounce button if it doesn't pounce you far enough in order to actually grab things? Canyon ruins, and then there's like glowing rocks, and then there's this weird totem thing here. What is this? A great treasure I carry. Are you worthy of it? Not me. Yes. Answer my three riddles correctly, and I may bestow my treasure upon you. Who's the doctor of the mystic, uh, Luna? That is not correct. Oh. Whoops. Oh well. Hopefully that's not important. Hopefully I can restart it later. Otherwise I'm fucked. Is that a hatch? Why is there just a freaking hatch here? I fucked up. Squawn dogged. Where did he, that emote even come from? It's so freaking weird. Why did Mike make that a thing? I don't know where I'm going or what I'm doing. I'm, I'm hunting, ostensibly. Oh no. I guess I'm in combat. I'm gonna just walk away from this. a never finished Earthbound for 64. You know more about it than I do. What the fuck is that? I'm gonna starve to death because I can't pounce right. Pouncing, you're attacking. Attacking is that. Pouncing is the other button, but it's the same button. It's... No, 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 it's okay, Sugar. I, I wanted to try it because it seemed like something I would enjoy. Have you played it any, uh, Sugar? I don't mean to sound like I'm complaining. I shouldn't look a gift horse in the mouth. Um, I just wanted to give it a little quick shot, see what it's like. Um, it seems okay. I'm just not very good at it, and I don't really get it. I'm wondering if the plot will make it better. Hey, Sarge, I'm dying. Can you help me out? Okay, I guess I'm just gonna start dying then. I mean, I have 0% food now, and I'm just gonna slowly start taking damage. Please help. Please help. Yes. Would you like to buy? I would like to buy. Oh my god, everything's so expensive. I mean, it just freaking mouse is 14 mews.
Can you eat the butterflies? You cannot eat butterflies. You can just catch them. Salt plants acquire food. I'm gonna... Here's a trick. If you're ever sad or hungry, just go to sleep. And then when you wake up, you won't be sad anymore. You'll still be hungry. But you might be able to ignore that you're hungry for a bit. And that'll say, can I just like put my face in the grass and just eat a whole bunch and then vomit it all up like Mo does whenever we take her outside? Can I do that? I mean, she does that with like most food. She's like completely incapable of like holding down food. I'm fairly certain. Okay. So if I'm in a bush, is am I stealthier? If you're hungry enough, you can sleep indefinitely. That's also true. There should be a stealth button. There is a stealth button, I just don't know how to use it right. Can you attack after the pounce? There's a bit of a delay. So I'm gonna just mash it as soon as it's... It may just be because I'm not good enough at fighting. You're pouncing the right way, just the RNG hates you. Okay, I'm just, I'm doing it right. I just need to keep trying until it works. Thank you for the five bits, Pipsqueak. Squeak. It's Pipsqueak. I just realized that that's what your name is. God, I'm dumb. Maybe I need to be closer? No, cause it seems like it can jump an infinite distance. Um, and also if I get too close, then they... What is this? Is this a thing? What the fuck? He found a power paw. Go on. You are filled with vigor by the ancient totem. Your maximum health was increased. Alright. I mean, I like cute animals. Valerian. I mean, if I start taking a whole shit ton of damage, then I'll just use some, um... AKA a star drop, yeah. I mean, it, any... You can compare this to, to Stardew fairly easily, yes. I'll just use some healing items. So healing items are also food. Technically. Untechnically. There we go. So it is just like sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. There's, that's the trick. Okay, I'm getting. I, I understand the game now. I understand how to like catch things. I should probably eat that, shouldn't I? All right, let's go. No, not hold. Eat. Okay. So it's just because my hunting skill is low, I have just like a really low chance of being able to actually catch it once I hit space. That's supposed to work every time. Or like a certain percentage of the time, I just suck at it really badly. There's like a fish here and we can just like, BAM! And then, now I'm being swept down river, I'm going to drown. I'm gonna drown, okay good. Can I upgrade more? Uh, yes. I'm gonna upgrade hunting a whole bunch. Yes. That seems more important than any other skill. Like fighting, I'll just avoid fights until I get enough food. Gathering ability. I like that the music kind of goes down when... Yeah, it was just I was fucking up on RNG. But now I'm just upgrading so I can... I, eventually I'll be able to eat reliably without losing. Okay. This game's a little bit better now that I understand what's happening. You should also attack faster. Or uh, upgrade fighting so you can attack faster. Okay. I should eat now. Yeah. I'm just gonna eat a whole bunch at once. I mean, I like that you can change what your cat looks like at any time. That's kind of cool. Um what I'd want from a game about cats.
Okay, I think I might have to go a little bit faster. Or a little bit closer. I don't think you call it a cat Sona. I think it's just a furry, right? If you believe your, I mean, what's the difference? I mean, I guess the difference between a furry and a cat is one is a cat, the other one's a furry. Play as your cat or Garfield. We're playing as um, Grit, Grit Slum. You're a little bit hungry. Yes, I've noticed. I'm okay now though, it's fine. Put some brown and put some green leaves on it. I mean, I think I'm okay. How does the cat hold stuff? Just like in its mouth? Oh, you mean like in its inventory? I don't know. Backpack? Little kitty backpack? That's actually really adorable now that I've thought of it. Yeah! You picked up a crow. Good. I mean, there's a huge difference between a cat and a furry. One of them... I would leave in my house unattended and feed for no reason other than I like its presence. The other one, I'd be a bit concerned. I mean, I guess I shouldn't say that. I mean, like, it's fine if you are, because honestly, we're all fated to die, so who gives a shit what you do with yourself? But, like, also... Cats are kind of dicks. I love you. Bro. I love you. Bro. You're kind of a dick. Bro. Like this morning when you woke me up at six. That was cute. It's a bit of a reason why I'm tired right now. All right. Is this anything like the Warriors book series? I think this is like not copyright infringing versions of that. Sell your meds. Yeah, let's just go. I mean, now that I know how to hunt, I'm gonna, like, use one of my meds. Am I healing slowly over time? Is that what that is? Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, so I only need, like, one. So I can sell the rest to Ember. Ember, talk to me. Yeah. Would you like to buy or sell? I would like to sell you a bunch of things. Uh, here is all of the shit that I want to sell you. Cool. Yes, I would like 30 Mews. All right, and then I would like to visit the shop again. Oh. Holy fuck. Cat shit is expensive. It's like Bitcoins. Shit just doesn't make any sense to me and I don't understand it. Okay, now I know how to hunt. Now what? Sell cat and it become drug dealer. Sure. Bit cats. Anyone here? Y'all hear about that? Bitcoins are worth a whole bunch. Of, what the fuck? Hi, Grit Slump. How are you today? Listen, there's something I want you to see. Tells something tells me you could help with it. Maybe you can restore the balance. Ah. <laughs> If you got a free moment, you can come to the sacred temple. It's right in the middle of the wilderness. You can find it on your map. I'll meet you there. Can we talk about that you're doing that? Alright. I, I guess I'm going there. Where's the map? Oh, okay. Oh, hey! There's a thing there. A battle rages here. So I guess I'm... S oh, and there's a mine? Okay. Oh, and then it's, I just go right. So there's like, okay. I got a general idea what's going on. I think you have like, not like actual Bitcoins, but like a percentage of a Bitcoin, because that's how Bitcoins work. It's one of those websites, it's on an older computer, so it probably has a virus. But um, it's one of those things that like, if you have like, I, I don't get, get 
coins. Like, I know that they're worth like $11,000 each, but I also don't understand why or how. Or like how you invest properly or anything about them. And, and, and I'm not a financial advisor guy, but I'm just gonna remind you that like, maybe, maybe do research on shit before you invest in it. Like that seems like solid advice. What's up? Good, you're here. Now I just have to make sure that no one else is around. Looks like we're alone. Okay. I'm about to show you a place that I've never shown anyone else. I think you'll be able to help me. Follow me, Gritslump. Down into the temple ruins. Okay. Bitcoins are like compensation slash representation for donated computer processing cycles, right? Dude, what? You watch videos and the video runs another co while the video runs another computer or company uses some of your competing power to research or whatever. But like it's just like the thing with the the cat the was it folding at home? It's like that, but like instead of helping cure cancer it's money. Is that right? Does anyone remember folding at home? It was like a screensaver that folded things. Okay. That seems like a computer using, or someone using my computer to get money or paying me to use my computer. Seems like a bad idea. Thank you for the 10 bits, Pipsqueak. Um, sometimes my cat screams at plants. I thought now would be a good time to mention it. It's probably the best time to mention it. it sounds not safe. Hello, Skillicorgi. This game is quirky. Cute, yes, as well, I guess. I think, I'm sure. Not sure. Anyway. Uh, this is where I live. I don't let most cats in here, but I've made an exception for- I mean, sorry, we just spent like the last five minutes. Um. Talking about Bitcoins. Okay. I don't know why, but it seems like something inside me is telling me that you can help with a small problem that I'm having. You see, I'm not the only one that lives here. These ruins are also the residence of the kindly nature spirit, the forest guardian that watches over all the wilds and maintains the balance between all living things. Now that the forest guardian is gone, the spirit vanished. One day the guardian was here. This doesn't sound like a small problem, like... Okay. I don't know what to do. Maybe the forest guardian is weakening. Maybe it's a test. I think you might be the solution to this mess. We should bounce some ideas off each other. There's a prophecy about arcane pillars that line the halls of the temple ruin. You can find them around the room. They look like dark standing stones. I see them, yes. The prophecy says that the pillars have to be endowed with some sort of power. I haven't figured out how to activate them just yet. Maybe you know how? Listen, I know it sounds crazy, but you have to try getting them to work. Check the pillars for me, won't you? Okay. Excuse. What did, what did you do? I mean, you don't know? Look, it's an arcane pillar. It's pulsing with light. How odd. It's like reacting to you. Of course, because I'm the player character. Aren't, like, Bitcoins worth more now because people think that they're worth more? Just like actual money? Like, isn't that why it's shot up in value? Because someone was like, holy shit, Bitcoins are worth a lot of money now. And then everyone's like, wow, that's awesome. Bitcoins are worth a lot of money now. I should invest. And then a bunch of people bought it, and then the market crashed for like a day. Then it went back. And now it's worth even more because a bunch of people bought them, and now everyone believes that Bitcoins are worth money again. I don't get cryptocurrency. Uh, well, this is a step in the right direction. Whoa, do you see those symbols above the pillar? What do you think it means? Death comes for us all. 
Maybe the pillar is trying to tell us something. Is this like an elaborate way for me to just feed you? Oh yeah, I have an idea. Maybe you should go collect all those items and bring them to this pillar. It might be enough to activate this power and bring the forest guardian back. Maybe it's to place all the items at the foot of the pillar. That just might work, okay. Three mouse, two squirrel, one rabbit, one black hare. All right, whatever. Bring animals. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go kill some shit. All right, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go see what these battles are. You're a little bit hungry. No, I'm not. Coco wants me to do, I mean, it's a fetch quest then that you want me to do here. Sacrifice the, the animals. Fucking jackass frog. Alright, uh, two more diagonally. One. Drowning, drowning, drowning. Okay. How dare that frog fend for his life? Yeah, I know, right? Marigold, good. One more. Okay, so there should be a fight going on here. No, I need to go over one screen. Go start. I mean, I'm just starting a. F oh, holy shit! Fuck! Oh god! Okay, I'm I'm bailing. Fuck this! Jesus Christ! Oh my god! This cat's just got murdered. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh god! Oh no! Oh god! Okay, don't even, don't even try. Oh god. Oh god. You're a little hungry. Okay, let's just take that and then eat that. Okay. My allies have perished. Like, I gotta go report this back. This one clan's just fucking us up. I would not take any financial advice from anyone in chat. That seems like a safe thing for me to say. Like, no no offense to anyone in chat, but like... That, that doesn't seem like a great idea. Do your own research. You know, figure out what you're doing. Is this Fortnite? I mean... No? Thank you for the 10 bits, Luigi, which is point zero 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 seven zero eight seven eight seven of a Bitcoin. Okay. <laughs> I like that book on <laughs> the $250,000 book on Amazon that says how I made $250 selling Amazon books with one in stock. That's an amazing article thing. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna go and uh, I I've been streaming for like two hours-ish now. Um, I think this is good if you are into the Warrior Cat series. I don't know anything about that. Um, it plays alright. I don't I think that the pouncing mechanic is really awkward and clumsy. Um, I think you could have a good time with this if you're, um, if this is your sort of thing. I've been streaming for exactly a single hour. I, I streamed another game before it, so together it was it was two hours. It's not part of the Warrior Cats. It's. It's, it seems like it's got a learning curve. It's got its charm. Let's check and see how much it is real quick. Uh, thank you, Sugar Shock. I'm sorry. Uh, I, I, I'm kind of bashing it a bit. I don't mean to be, but I, I just want to be honest with people uh, in case if they're interested. Um, I want them to know.
my opinion. This is the it's fifteen bucks. Yeah. Uh fifteen bucks. You can get the deluxe edition uh for an extra thirteen ninety nine, which includes the original soundtrack and deluxe content. Uh it doesn't explain really what that is. Um it looks like additional art and maybe Uh, orange bangle, uh, color thing. And then the art book. Yeah, okay. Well, it was nice of you to buy this for me, Sugar Shock. Um, I, I think, unless if this is incredibly popular, um, like, on After Hours, I think this will be the last of it for me. Um... But yeah, let's let's check the art real quick. Uh, let's see if there's any art that needs to be shown. No. Okay. I'm going to come back with um, Hearthstone probably tomorrow. Uh, let's see if my meme deck actually works. And then uh, we'll, we'll go from there. Um, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to run another ad. Uh, and then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bounce out of here. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you tomorrow. Uh, right around like... Well, actually, I need to find out what time uh, Kobolds and Catacombs releases. Um, uh, release time. Yeah, let's see. Because it's, it, it's released tomorrow and the next day? For whatever reason? It, it will be... Um, I'll keep freeloading, yes. It will be released at 11 a.m. Uh, or 1 Central Standard Time. Okay, so I'll stream, how about at like 1 Central Standard Time. It's currently 7.23, my time. I'll stream some uh, Hearthstone and then I'll, um, I'll stream some more shit um, closer to 5. We'll see how it goes. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed yourselves at least. I'll see you guys later. Bye! Alright, I actually have to turn off the stream. Bye!